Hello everyone, let's go over the subdivisional editing tools within Gravity Sketch. Firstly, it's important to note that any GS tool can be converted into a subd sketch object. From the ink tool to volumes, we convert these sketch objects after creating them. For primitives, subd can be activated prior to creating the sketch object, and only certain primitives are convertible. Once created or converted and within edit mode, pull up subd editing tools by pressing and holding the black button on your drawing hand indicated by a hammer and paintbrush icon. Hover your controller over a tool and release the black button to equip it. Each of these tools are used by squeezing the index trigger on your drawing hand controller. The loop addition tool is the default sub de editing tool, so let's start here. It is used to create points, edges, and entire edge loops within your sketch object. It's best to add as few points as necessary when sub de modeling, so be intentional with the edges you add. The Precise Selection tool selects individual faces or vertices at a time. Notice the pink sphere above your controller. This area is meant to be at a set size. This tool is helpful when you have overlapping points and need to separate them. The Smoothing tool attempts to create a more continuous form by dispersing points across your object's surface. Smoothing tool area can be changed by toggling up and down on your drawing hand toggle. The Edge Cut tool adds individual edges within a surface. Cuts can begin at a point or along an edge. It is best to keep subd surfaces four-sided, especially when creating edge loops, but edge cut can be used to create three, five, and even six-sided faces for specific instances. The crease tool defines the edges of your sketch object. Select an edge with the red cursor to crease. Once creased, you'll notice the edge becomes blue. Quickly crease an entire edge loop by holding your non-drawing hand index trigger prior to selecting your edge. This will highlight your entire edge loop, and the crease will then be applied throughout. The merge tool is meant for combining two sub-D sketch objects together, allowing them to be edited as one. To merge, have one object selected and present your merge tool upon the desired merging object. You'll notice it appear highlighted in red. Pull the index trigger on your drawing hand to merge. Merging sketch objects will also match their surface thickness. The separation tool is designed to detach surfaces from the sketch objects they reside on. Select the face or faces you would like to separate by hovering your tool over them. They will appear highlighted in red and once selected, press the blue button when finished to edit your two separate sketch objects.